Well, a place to ski, snowboard, and tube just minutes from Rochester. Mazeppa Ski Hill re reopened this year for the first time in 16 years. Steeplechase will open for tubing this Saturday and for skiing and snowboarding in about two weeks. However, this year's warm weather challenged the Steeplechase team in getting everything ready. Here's Eric Min with more. With the lack of snow this year, the weather isn't the best for Steeplechase to open its ski hill. However, with these snow machines, it's not impossible. So snow making is definitely uh, something we have to do, and especially a year like this year where we haven't got any snow. So uh, these, sh these machines are brand new. We just started using them last night, and they work great. Using his 19 snow machines, Justin Stack says he is working to get ready for tubing by this weekend. He says the ski hill will not open until December 9th. You know, the ski hill has a lot more snow to make, so that's kind of depends on what the forecast gives us. But we know we can get the snow tubing open in just a few nights uh, with some good temps. Stack says anyone can snow tube. He encourages visitors, regardless of age, to come try tubing this weekend. The whole environment is a lot of fun. It's family friendly and with, uh, yeah, right after, you know, kind of in the heart of COVID is when we opened the first year tubing and that was a little simpler the first year and then we've kind of been building on each year and then this year with the skiing. Stack says the ski hill should open in two weeks if the weather cooperates. He says Steeplechase will update its Facebook page if there are any changes. In Mazeppa, Eric Min, KTTC News. And for tickets, hours, and holiday schedules, you can visit Steeplechase's website through the link in our web story.